So therefore, the nature of matter is that it is a transitory energy. It's transitory. It's a bit like a dream. As Shakespeare put it very nicely, the world is but a stage and everyone in it is an actor. Isn't it? We're all acting out a certain part. Someone is thinking, I'm Miss Gorgeous. Someone is thinking, I'm Mr. Strongman. Someone is thinking, I'm a great pop star. Someone is thinking, I'm a real brain. Someone is thinking, I'm a big businessman. Someone is thinking, I'm the president of this country. Someone is thinking, I'm a holy man. Someone is thinking that I'm a, a, a very a clever man. So all of these different types of consciousness, they are manifested in different types of forms and shapes. But the soul, actually, the real form of the soul is coming from the spiritual plane. Consciousness belongs to consciousness. Consciousness does not belong to matter. If you mix consciousness with matter, it is called a, what we call an embarrassing situation. So that's the nature of consciousness. Consciousness is looking for pleasure. We want to have pleasure and therefore we are trying to create the environment. We are trying to create an environment within matter which is pleasurable. that due to mechanical faults on the track, there may be severe delays and difficulties, but this is due to circumstances beyond our control.
uh, festival. Yes, thank it's you good. very much. Did you? Yes. Where are you from? I've enjoyed it very much. It's a very nice book. If you, read, you should read it, actually. It's very educational. This one is, this one is different. Yeah, they're both different, you see? Different cover. This is Krishna book, yeah. You would read them, they're very, very interesting. This is the teachings of Lord Chaitanya. Teachings. Yeah.